Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my nail polish picks for fall and winter. And if you know me, you know that I don't restrict myself to wearing a certain kind of color for a certain kind of season. But for this video, I've chosen the nail polishes that I think are most appropriate for fall and winter. So let's go ahead and get started. Um, first nail polish, and uh, just to let you know, this is in no particular order. It's from Revlon, and this one it's called Facets of Fuchsia. And I'm sure a lot of you have seen this color before. It's a black base nail polish with fuchsia or purpley uh, shimmers in it. Well, it's actually not shimmers. It's very chunky glitter. And it looks very, very pretty on the nails, and I really like it. You only need two coats to get what you see in the bottle. The only thing is that I wish you could see more glitters because... I don't know if you can tell that the glitters are kind of gathered up all around the bottle and then when you take the nail polish out, I don't know, I don't feel like you get as much glitter as um, you would want it to come out, but it's nonetheless a beautiful color and I highly recommend it. Next nail color is in Owl's Night and this one is from L'Oreal, this is actually my very first um, L'Oreal nail polish I've ever owned and it's very pretty it's a black base nail polish with kind of um, it's like an olive green or kind of like a gold with a green toned shimmer in it and it's very very beautiful it looks very pretty on the nails and I really like this one next one is a nice metallic shade and it's from Orly and this one is in Rage. Um, I don't know if the camera is going to pick it up very well, but this nail polish is pretty much a mix of silver and rose gold shimmer in it. And it's just beautiful. It's a very unique color. Um, I really, really love it. I think metallic shades are very, very in for fall and winter. It's just beautiful and I love this color. Next one is from Revlon, and this one is in Devilish, and I don't know how the camera is picking this up, but this is a really nice, true, like, blood red nail polish. It is beautiful, um, it looks like very put together, it makes your nails look really nice, it looks very professional, and I love the way this nail polish looks. It has no shimmers or glitters whatsoever, it's a cream finish, and with two coats, you're good to go, so I really like this color. Next one is the one that I'm wearing on my nails right now, and it's in Manhattan from NYC. You can get this for $2 at the drugstore. Um, it's a really nice color, cream finish, no shimmers or anything like that. And I think just like the Revlon nail, nail color, it makes your nails look very put together, very clean, very professional. So I really like this, and with two coats, you're good to go. It's not streaky at all, so I really like the quality of these nail polishes for the price that you pay. Next nail polish is from Milani and this one is in Brown Alicious. And it is a really nice kind of like maroon nail polish. It's like a brown reddish color with like I don't know like copper shimmers in it. It's very very pretty. I really like it. It makes your nails look very put together as well and I love this color. And I think it's very, very fall appropriate because, you know, it reminds me of the leaves changing colors and stuff like that. So I really like it. Next one is from Orly and this one it's in Fantasia. It's a really nice purple nail polish with gold shimmers in it. And it's just beautiful, very unique. Um, I don't own anything else like it and I really, really enjoy wearing this color. Um, for this one, you would need about three coats to get what you see in the bottle, but nonetheless, it's a beautiful color and I really like wearing it for fall and winter. Next nail polish is another purpley shade and this one is from CQ. You can get this brand at the drugstore. I got mine from, I think it was Rite Aid um, and it's very as affordable as well. Um, this one is very nice and pigment pigmented. Um, it has some shimmers in it, and as you can see, it's not like a deep color, but I think it's, um, I don't know, purple and dark enough for fall, so it's, it's a beautiful color. 
Next nail polish, um, if you've been with me since my old channel, you've seen it before. It's still a very, very favorite of mine. And this one is in See You Soon from Sinful Colors. It's only $2 from the drugstore and it is a beautiful color. It's a black base nail polish with um, like green and blue shimmers in it. It's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. I absolutely love it. Next nail polish is kind of like a metallic -y shade and it's from Revlon as well. As you can see, Revlon is my most favorite drugstore uh, nail polish brand. I think they have a really nice selection of colors and the pigmentation and the application. It's, it's really good for the price. And this one is in Smoldering. It's like a silver nail polish with green and purpley reflex in it. I'm not sure if you will be able to see it on the camera, but it's a beautiful, beautiful color. And metallics are great for fall and winter, like I said before. Now here's another color. This one is from Avon. And this one it's in Texture Teal. And as you can see, it's like a nice navy blue color. I really love this color. It's cream, and it's a cream finish and it has no shimmers in it whatsoever. So I really like that. Now my last two nail polishes are uh, nude nail polishes. So when I'm not wearing those really dark colors, I go for the nudes, which is like the totally opposite side of things. But I really like the way it looks um, on the nails. It looks very clean, very put together. I think it looks very professional and I really like it. This ones are cream finishes and this one is from Revlon. It's called Elegant and it's a nice nude color, uh, like a gray, grayish nude color, pretty much. That's the only way I can describe it. And this one is more like a beigey nude. This one is from Julie G and it's called Chick Zebra. So those are my two favorite nude nail polishes. So that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope you found some nail polish ideas, maybe new nail polishes that you will want to get for yourself. And if you have any nail polishes that you, that you really like and that you think are your favorites, please leave them in the comment section below. I would like to check them out. Maybe I see a new color that I would like to get for myself. Um, obviously, I'm probably going to pick up more colors for the fall and winter and if they're good enough um, and I really like them, I might show them in another video just to update you guys as to what nail polishes I've been wearing. So that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next one. Bye!